this is for the Don, Don Rickles, I believe his name was. The Don Rickles, what is his name? Don Rickles 5, whatever, 45. I like you too, Don Rickles. I think you've been funny throughout all my, you know, childhood watching your shows. Don Rickles, I love your, your, your movies and everything, but I'm going to have to break it down for you. Just like my attorney did for me yesterday, baby. She says, you don't have a record. You come from a crime family. <laughs> Your dog is crazy. She didn't say that, though. But look, she basically told me I was right. Just like I've been telling you all along. And like I said, I stopped within five blocks of the lights coming on. By law, you're supposed to park in a well-lit, safe place. Even though it was daytime, I felt it safer for my son to get out in the driveway of the house. Okay? The car was malfunctioning. I can go see my mechanic. As a matter of fact, I have to do it today. Thanks, Mr. Rickles, for reminding me. So he can just give me the paperwork of what he did for my car. That would prove what I said was true. But hey, you, you nibble on my finger again, man. I'm going to send you to Don Rickles' house. The Don Rickles uh, 45. Yeah, get away from me, puppy. Romeo, if you give me a hard time, I'm going to turn you into that cop. She'll taser your little butt. So listen, Rickles, this is what happened, man. Like my attorney told me, baby. You got nothing to worry about, AIX. Slam dunk, baby. Slam dunk. But they still want to try to put something on my driver's license. I'm not having that. Because I was not drunk. Please. I pulled over in the safest area for my child, physically possible, based on what's happening in today's times, baby. Shit. They just jacked the wrong cat, baby. That's how it was. It could have been because I was black, or it could have been, hey, like the lady said, it looked like the car swerved when I hit the corner. Fine. But it didn't take didn't take nobody tasering. The guy pulling the driveway and he's standing with his hands out at the back of his fucking car. You don't scream, get back in the car. Come on, man. The rule is, you don't put a so-called suspect back in the car. What a so-called child. Come on, man. And like my attorney told me, yeah, if you would have stopped two blocks from the house, just because of suspicion, they would have had to process your child. How did you know that? Look it up on the computer, baby. Type in my last name, baby. I've seen them do this to my family members. I've seen them try to do it to my stepbrothers. The hell you gonna tell me? Stop my car a block short from my house, knowing I got a minor in the car? Somebody on their way to college? You think I'm gonna throw his life away on a humbug? You got me fucked up, Don Rickles. I mean, the Don Wrinkles. So, um, I like Don. I'm just, I'm just fucking with you, because you know how you guys do it. That's why I ain't worried about this. But I'm going to hit you, Don. Because your video was good. It was good. It was all right. Not like, um, what's that guy? What's that guy's name? He used to do videos. Uh, number one asshole. You're not as good as the number one asshole. You're way better than the number three asshole. I can tell you that much. So listen. Mr. Wrinkles. I told the lady. If I pull over a block before I get to the house. My son's a minor. Come on. And she says, yeah, they would have had to process him and his mother would have had to come get him. So that means he would have been stripped down just like a regular, regular, just like a regular man. Balls showing, just like they did me, the guy's sitting there looking at my nuts and shit. Come on, man. Lift that up. You know how degrading it is when they book you? Huh, that's cool. Little black kid needs to get that shit out of his system, right? Is that how you motherfuckers feel about that, Wrinkles? I would have did the same thing with your grandkids in the fucking car. 
because I understand the significance. They would have done that to a white kid. They would have done that, man. They would have done that to your um 15 year old daughter if she had a baby in the car. That's it, buddy. This is California, buddy. They give you a number, baby. A fucking tracking number. Unlike the one that the government gives you, baby. You know that social security card slave number you got, baby? These are your people and your rules. You stop your car. You let them into your life. You give up your soul to these people. Don, I won't go out like that. I am not made to be allowed to go out like that. Not even when they tried to take me as a child. I did not go out like that. And as a man, you think I'm going to let them take my child? My future? My namesake? You got me fuck twisted, baby! But I ain't never going out like that. I'd die a thousand times, bullets raining from all around me, before I give somebody my child. I'd walk through five backwards doing the Michael Jackson moonslide with no shoes on to save my kid. I swim through shark infested waters without even knowing how to swim to get to mine. I'd fight lightning and God himself to make sure my child can live another day. And please, baby, I am all that everybody wished they could be. And all that ever came before me wish they can achieve to a bit. I'm not needing. I'm not hungry. And I serve no man. Hey. I am not giving you a steak. A piece of chicken. A hot link. Or nothing up in here. Alright. Every time I eat. You want to eat. I already spoiled you. Okay? You weigh 10 pounds, damn near, man. You're supposed to be a lap dog. You're losing it. Beat it. Get out of here for a minute. Please. And as far as the crippled cocksucker comes, he comes and goes. He's like a bad smell. He's like when somebody shit in your bathroom ain't supposed to be in your house. But I still love him too. As stupid and as dumb as he may be, you guys both tell truth in what you say. Stop the fucking car. I know that. If my son wasn't in the car, I probably would have stopped. But based on what's happening in the news, I probably would have pulled in my driveway anyway. I did a reenactment video. I did a bunch of videos that are sh that I'm gonna shut down. I must make these videos private because they will place my so-called case in jeopardy. But I'm not really giving a damn about my case. I don't care. I accomplished my damn goal. They didn't steal my son. They didn't have a chance to go make him strip down, put on some damn jail clothes, take a picture and fingerprint him for three hour wait till his mama come get him when he's only 275 yards from his own front door. You got me twisted, baby. But need I explain myself anymore? Never again. Because I did on that last video. And somehow I can't even see the video. And this one, they probably won't even let me see this either. They probably monitor you guys to make me say something wrong. And right now, at this point, I accomplished my goal, so I'm really not giving a fuck. So, Don, slide down on something. You look like you could work the pole. Next time my um, sister-in-law and her girls want to get together, I might hire you to be their stripper. They like them little Italian types and shit. So, look. You guys have fun out there and make believe gangster land. And right here in the reality of the real, 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 real baby, when you come back to the real, 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 you'll understand exactly what's going on. Because I can be a character, but for what? The character I have is already interesting enough. Thank you. You guys have a nice day. And yeah, for old time's sake, you've been tubed. <laughs>